we are back with a new video review and today we're going to do a quick little review on these two products one is fairly new um, the other one was uh, in trader joe's stores and i believe they still sell it so the first product we're going to quickly take a look at is this camel milk with soap and it has olive oil and honey it doesn't have any fragrance it's paraben free sulfate free take a look at this little ingredient list bam right there uh, it's a product of Turkey and they list all the ingredients which I'll just leave there for a second so you can take a look at it so here is a shot of the actual soap this little pouch it comes in and from what I was reading it looks like camel milk soap has a lot of benefits um, a natural source of alpha hydroxy acids it looks like it has a lot of anti-aging properties as well and it's supposed to like plump your skin and smooth out fine lines and reduce signs of aging such as pigmentation and age spots which, although trader joe's doesn't advertise on the back of their little package here i just wanted to look that up i'm assuming that our expiration date or best use date i don't know what they call these it's 5 15 2020 yeah i believe this was two dollars i picked this up right before the holidays so i thought i was going to give it away as like a gift but i ended up just keeping it the cute little stamp they have there on their packages usual trader joe's has really nice packaging so i am going to try this i'm going to use it to wash my face and i'll let you know what i think of this soap itself all right so i just used this to wash my face and one thing that I noticed was it I actually lathered this side of the bar quite a bit and usually with soaps I don't know if you have this experience but it's very slippery or sudsy it dried up real fast it's very interesting I've never had that experience before I already can tell I, I really like it my face feels very like refreshed yeah I want to keep using it I'll definitely do a follow-up on this and let you guys know long term what I think of it I'm interested to see how my face reacts to it because I'm really sensitive when it comes to soaps anything that has like a harsh chemical I react to real quick and start breaking out and so forth but overall two dollars for this bar of soap that probably lasts quite a while is a pretty good deal um, in my opinion we'll share his thoughts in the written review this new mouthwash that was recently released at Trader Joe's and what's unique about it is that it is made with tea tree oil and cool mint and as they've nicely advertised freshens breath helps brighten teeth and is sugar free and alcohol free I've already tried it it smells real minty very nice but it definitely has the taste of tea tree oil you can really feel it as you are gargling and or just uh, rinsing your mouth with this you can kind of tell it has a little bit of a light yellow tint to the actual mouthwash and that is coming from the tea tree oil I'm definitely gonna keep using it I typically use the big name brand and um, their ingredients from what I can tell that they list alcohol glycerin hydrogen hydrogen peroxide which is something that i typically look for maybe it's not good for me but it definitely does help me uh, to keep oral hygiene going there are some ingredients here that i am not at all aware of but one thing that they also list is zinc citrate which is this little ingredient listed here it's supposed to help you brighten your teeth I haven't used it too many days to really see if that is actually true I mean everybody kind of advertises that um, even the big name brands that they um, brighten or your teeth overall but who knows what kind of chemicals are putting in there Nathan usually uses like the Listerine or something that's generic is similar to Listerine now this was $3.99 and it's definitely still available at Trader Joe's stores anyhow those is just a quick little video review if you guys have tried these two products before let us know your thoughts in the comment section of this video otherwise have a great week and uh, we will be back very soon